It looks like fall has made its return back into our area. Good evening out there. This is Water Forecaster Ryan Crump, and I'm here with your evening update. Currently, right now, we have those cool temperatures in this area, 48 degrees currently right now in Indianapolis, 49 degrees in Muncie, 50 degrees here in South Bend at this hour. And it has really cooled off from this time yesterday. Look at these temperatures. We have seen a major drop off in the temperatures. Look at 25 degrees cooler than it was at this time yesterday in Indianapolis, 27 degrees in Shelbyville, and Muncie is sitting at 26 degrees. Now, this is interesting. Just at this time yesterday, we were sitting at uh, basically 80 degrees and now we have to look worried about a possible freeze warning just the next day. That tells you how much these temperatures are really have fluctuated in this uh, in this area. We're pretty much transitioning from a fall uh, to a, a warm to a cold season. But look at this. We have a freeze warning. It's just how ironic how things could change in just a short period of time. But this is exactly what's happening right now. We have a freeze warning that's going into this morning and early this tomorrow morning. We also have to worry about those uh, winds because they will be biting out there as well. Look at these wind gusts out here. South, southwest of Indian Indianapolis at eight miles an hour and six miles an hour southwest and Muncie. Uh, as we go through this radar, you can see that most of the range has moved off to our east right now. Uh, but the same, same thing, we have some um, more rain. And this is actually ahead of a cold front that came into our area. And basically, you know, dump, it dumped some pretty decent amounts of rain. And we, good news, we do have some more rain coming in the forecast as we go through this weekend and into early next week. Because we really could use that rain. Hopefully this makes a bit of a dent in our, our rain to, rainfall deficit. For right now, for the next eight hours, you're going to see that those temperatures, it's going to be a cloudy start, but those skies will eventually begin to break and clear out as we go through the night. And the temperatures are actually going to begin to fall off a little bit as well. And you're going to see this is going to be pretty much one of the chilliest temperatures that you see this, uh, this fall, uh, fall season so far. As you look here tonight, mostly clear, cold, low of 31 degrees and winds at the west northwest at 5 to 10 miles an hour. And you look at precision cast, again, you see these clouds in the area early, but they're going to begin to move out as we go through the night tonight into tomorrow. And as you see, you're going to see some few passing clouds, but they're not going to make too much of a difference in, uh, in a, a sunshine cover. We're going to still have mostly sunny skies as we go through the day. Now, you will see them move back into the area late on Saturday night ahead of another rain system on Sunday. We'll get to in just a moment, but take a look at this uh, for the, uh, tomorrow morning. You may, better make sure you want, uh, bring that extra jacket out there because you're going to need it this uh, tomorrow morning. The temperatures will be 34 degrees. It will be, however, mostly sunny, but it ain't going to make too much of a difference as we go. It will warm up uh, as we go through the afternoon, but still won't make too much of a difference in the temperatures. It will only going to be at 57 degrees at that time. For this weekend, however, we're going to see those sunny skies, 61 degrees. And tomorrow, as the winds out south at 10 to 20 miles an hour. For Sunday, 61 degrees, but we're going to have those showers in the area. And that's just going to be uh, something you're going to see a little bit as we go. Through, I'll show you on the seven day forecast. As you see here, look at all of this rain chances, something we desperately could use for this time of the year, uh, for this time right now. We are basically running well below average in the temperatures, but look at that 34 degrees. Uh, for a low and yes, it, we, I know we don't like to see fall come back, but fall is actually going to be in the area. But we do see those temperatures moderate a little bit as we go through Wednesday, as we see the temperatures back into the 70s, but we actually cool back down to the 60s or Thursday. Check us out on Newsweek Indiana Weather for more updates.